It's straight jacket day here at Mucus Asylum Stadium here in Luniapolis, Craziana, home of the insane Colts. The first 1,000 fans will receive a free straight jacket in a 500 volt lobotomy. Am I crazy? Or did I just see a fan throw himself off the upper deck in a garbage can with an M80 in his mouth? No, that's their mascot, Crazy Jimmy. <laughs> Quite the entertainer, isn't he? And this is going to be a bloody game. The teams are loading their weapons and sharpening their spikes. The Baltimore Razors battle. The Insane Colts. Welcome to MFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. The paddy wagons in the parking lots are full. The familiar scent of bodily fluids in the air. And the men's room is both flooding and on fire. And that means MFL game day is on the air. Hi, everyone. Grim Blitzer along with Bricks and Bricks Jr. And last week, some mutant let out a lava blast in one of the stalls in the men's room. Place went up like an oil rig. Flames and explosions. Water shooting out of where the toilets were. <laughs> I electrocuted myself using the electric hand dryer. I wish they had paper towels at least as an option. I scribble and scribble. I own hell and I'll sell them all. The burn returner was maimed by the opposing team, so it's up to the next man to replace him. Yeah, what exactly is a burn returner, Grim? You know, players who catch kickoffs and punts and run them back through the teeth of the defense. They have the lowest survivability rate of any player in the league. The next man up just sat back down on the bench. He probably cramped his pants. And it's first and ten. is getting kills. Uh, this is a really violent game, guys. It's fantastic. <laughs> and it's first and ten. Receiver has to make that catch. Now he put the team in a hole. Second down and ten. And he picks up eight yards on a strong run. Third and two. Well, fee, five, fo, fum. I not said And the defense was reading him like a book. Like it was written in Braille, Grim. His hands were all over the ball. Holy hell. He refused. Oh, man, his neck vertebrae just got crushed. Sounded like a gorilla sitting on a bag of potato chips. As they say at the deli, who's next? Well, uh, can I get a Swiss on rye with uh, no mustard? And it's first and ten. And that'll be second down and four. Yo, man, nobody can touch me when I ball. I take all you mutants out. That's right. What you talking about? Third down and, well, good luck. up eight yards on that pass. Ooh. 
And he lines up for the field goal attempt, trying to ignore the defensive threats of murder. And goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuffed burrito from Taco Hell. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if the defense can hold them. Just catch it, run it back, and don't die. And it's first and ten. Ooh, hope he's got a good chiropractor. Oh, and the late hit arrives right on time. When it's your time to go, it's your time. And that'll be second down and four. Hot. Hot one. Hot. At this rate, the QB's going to have more interceptions than completion. He's leaving a wake of destruction in his path, and the body toll continues to climb. And it's first and ten. Second down, and he tired of the quarterback's tight spirals and magnetic person. And that unsportsmanlike play of the day brought to you by the good folks at Speedy's drive through Funeral Parlor Service, located just off the Beltway, exit five. And it's first and ten. Oh, the defender lays down a wicked hit and knocks the ball loose. The receiver just got smashed. Not as bad as me last night. He may be dead, but trust me, he's in better shape than I am right now. Oh, geez, here it comes. Blah. Blow up the defense today. <laughs> he was right. Third down and ten. The defender says, I don't think so. You know, sometimes the best thing to do is just punt and let your defense get the ball back. Played by my kids. And he just lets that one go. He says, no, thank you. And the defense downs it. And it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. Hot three. And he's off to the races. Look at that little mutant run. Remember that being an officially sanctioned NFL rule. <laughs> They're back up here on first, and the offense jumps off sides to kill the ref. They say, We're mad as hell and not going to take it anymore. First down in a mile. Hot one, hot two. He might have managed to dig out a yard. Oh, holy smokes! He just killed that player with a cheap shot. That's why we love the MFL. Second down, and we've got to pick up at least half of this. Good thing they did drug testing in the MFL, because whenever they do, that's a six-yard gain on that catch.
third down and long. And he breaks away. And he picks up about six on the play. And they'll line up for the punt here. And he got it off. That's a decent punt. And he snags the punt and looks for open field. I had a dog named Snags. Boom, and he's dead. Oh, bingo, bingo, bingo. I got bingo, Grim. He's running out of gas now. The 20. Oh, man, Bricks, you got to love a player who goes down fighting. First and ten. And picks up maybe a deuce at most. Uh, speaking of deuces, I gotta, uh... <clears throat> hey, you got a dollar for the bathroom attendant? He threatened me if I didn't tip him next time. Just some good old downhill running there as he picks up the first down. Oh, that was totally uncalled for. And that's why we love the NFL. And it's first and ten. We've got a nail biter at the end of one. And it's first and ten. with a shovel, Graham? I have. And trust me, the hit that guy just took was worse. And it's first and ten. The offense is pretty much unstoppable when they use their beast boost injection. Close your eyes, Briggs. This is going to get ugly fast. He broke free and has open field and free. Bam! Say goodnight to that guy, Briggs. Uh, good night to that guy, Briggs. point but this guy could blow it it goes right through yeah like a double stuff burrito from taco hell when you give up points you need to get them back here comes the kickoff let's see if they can make them pay Don't you just love the sound of bones snapping and cracking? I mean, when they're not yawning. And it's first and ten. Second down and more than the QB would like. Boom, dead and down. He delivered the freaky fast ham a sandwich with extra mustard for the death blow. Speaking of ham sandwiches, I'm going to go grab one. You want anything? No, yeah, still working on my salami here, Briggs. Thanks. That's what she said. Ah, ah, didn't work that time. It was close, though. Yep. Gets another pick. Man, rough. Oh, the old broke back mountain play. Got hit by a mountain of Newton. Got his back broken, and now he's in a mountain of pain. Ooh. 
And it's first and ten. Oh, devastating hit. You ever get hit that hard, Bricks? Yep. Third grade. Sister Mary Margaret of Our Ladies of Holy Hell. I thought it was brass knuckles, but it was just a regular knuckles. And that's perfect coverage. Nice deflection. Third down and nine. If that hit didn't cripple him, it certainly left skid marks. And it's first and ten. And he sticks his fingers in the defender's eyes, netting him a pickup of about eight on the play. Second down and two. That pass was way off target, but I'm pretty sure the QB will blame the receiver as he always does. Third and two. Boom to the moon. Another loser bites the dust. In the NFL, winning is really about how much you want it, Bricks. Well, he clearly didn't want to live as much as the other guy. That's a good point, Grim. And kickers practice for this kind of kick every day. Pretty standard. Nothing standard when you got bloodthirsty mutants on the defensive line. Well, surprise me. He made it look easy, and he gets three points for it. The home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. meets the explodable object. Say what? Come on, man. You can't hang with me. You get my grill, I'm going to ruin your world. You understand me? The burn returner was killed on that play. The coach will replace him with another player. And it's first and ten. the ball on that one. The ref goes a penalty. You know, the NFL has eliminated almost every penalty in the rule book, and yet it still feels like there's way too many penalties. Stupid jerks. You guys suck. Yeah. And it's first and ten. Watch out. The ball carries <laughs> Just a great run for a touchdown. Well, this should be an easy chip shot extra point, but you never know with kickers. <laughs> Straight through the uprights. The best kind of kick is when it's right after a score. Hey, speak for yourself. I'm usually the one who gets kicked after scoring. You've got to avoid those spikes or you'll be a mutant pincushion. I was a chubby kid, Grim. My parents sent me to fat camp. My big brother told me as soon as he get there, stab the first kid you see and no one will mess with you. So I get off the bus at the camp, some kid runs up to me and stabs me. It's a savage. Oh, and the defender knocked the ball out when he was in midair. It is a, oh, come on, that was a cheap shot. <laughs> That's why I love this guy. And so are the fans.
Second down and six. And he reels that one in for a first down to keep the drive alive. And it's first and ten. Another one bites the dust. <laughs> the offense is down to their last running back. When he bites the dust, they can only pass. Yeah, well, at least they don't have to flop it, man. That's right, but now the defense can focus on killing the receivers. First down at six. Does the QB know which team he's on? I don't even know where I'm at. Well, that is one big mutant sandwich down there. One guy's dead. The coach isn't liking that call. Oh, oh his head just exploded. What a miss, what a miss. Oh, shit. First down and three. It's a jailbreak. And the defense jumps offside to kill the ref. Ho oh, ho! Crowd's loving it. First down and one. And the NFL keeps pounding out the death hits on W. NFL 98.8, the greatest hits of all time. Huh? Did you just say greatest hits? Well. And that'll be second and eight to go. Not one, eight. Oh, man, his neck vertebrae just got crunched. Sounded like a gorilla sitting on a bag of potato chips. As they say at the deli, who's next? Well, I'll and that's a hell of a cheap shot. <laughs> Gotta love it. The offense has only one quarterback left. If he dies, it's game over. Yeah, this new QB don't even look too confident. He's bleeding with the coach on the sidelines about something. Yeah, he's telling his coach to punt. What a pussy. Third down and five. And he rumbles into the end zone for the score. I hope he's not going to dance now. <laughs> okay, nice and easy like a two-foot putt. You miss two-foot putts all the time, Grim. It's good. When you get knocked down, you got to get right back up and fight. Uh, what about when you get knocked up? What do you do then? Run. He's leaving a wake of dust. You've got to avoid those spikes or you'll be a mutant pincushion. I was a chubby kid, Grim. My parents sent me to bed. Turner was maimed by the opposing team, so it's up to the next man to replace him. Yeah, what exactly is a burn returner, Grim? Now, players who catch kickoffs and punts and run them back through the teeth of the defense. They have the lowest survivability rate of any player in the league. The next man up just sat back down on the bench. He probably
proudly cramped his pants. The offense goes into their two-minute drill. What the hell is that? It's the same thing as a hurry-up offense, you moron. I am so confused. First down. I see this guy. Oh, holy Montezuma's revenge. That's a crap your pants and die tackle. Oh, that Montezuma was very vengeful, wasn't he, Bricks? Wonder what made him so mad. That was probably all the diarrhea. Yeah, you're probably right. Yeah, they probably ran out of toilet paper when he was in some all-inclusive resort, and he just got so mad and cursed everyone who came to Mexico forever to crap their pants. Uh, sounds like he didn't really think it through, because, you know, he should have made it specifically for the owners of the inclusives, but they got out the guests. What the fuck are you talking about? Uh, I don't really know right now. What day is it? They need a good return here to set up the offense. He sets up for the return. Let's see if he can break one wide open. Oh, now the offense is getting kills. Uh, this is a really violent game, guys. It's fantastic. And that's the end of the second quarter. Someone will need to pull together some bribe money as they head to their lockers. Stay with us for the Halftime Show, brought to you by our friends at Monsatan Industries. We make genetically altered Franken food you'll have fun trying to identify. Well, the third quarter coming up. Bricks, this game has been a hot mess so far. Yeah, kind of like the morning after eating hot chicken wings. It's a hot mess on the exit ramp, if you know what I mean. <laughs> Here comes the kicker. Oh, I can't wait to hear this. What's the kicker, Grim? Uh, this guy in the field. Oh, I thought you were going to tell me a story like, here's the kicker. When I turned on the light, it wasn't a broad in my bed. It was a chimp wearing a wig. Come up with 10 yards on the play. Second down, the size of Bricks Wiener. Hey! Sorry, partner. And there's another pick. Man, this quarterback must have learned a lot about sharing when he was. Oh, that was a big hit. Hey, Bricks, I'll bet you took a lot of shots like that over your career. Let's see. About a quarter after three, Grim. But my watch is a bit slow. And it's first and ten. And the defense jumps on sides, trying to mutilate the QB. And in some leagues, you aren't even allowed to touch the QB. In the NFL, yeah. they have plays just for killing them. <laughs> That's what I'm talking about. The offense lost another quarterback on the previous play and have only two left before they have to forfeit. Yeah, but on the bright side, Grim, they save a ton of money by not having to pay those guys anymore. I don't think the funeral expenses, that is. And it's first and ten. Oh, great play! He is on that receiver like glue! Smart man, Bricks. Very smart. Second down and ten. Well, the QB is dinking and dunking the defense to sleep. <laughs> One yard on that pass. Third down and nine. And he just put that guy out of his misery and says, Who's next? running back. No rest for the weary. The last runner has to suck it up and hopefully not die. Don't do anything stupid here. Just punt the damn ball and play defense. And he put all of his foot into that one. And he's got a chance for a good return. 
turn here. That, my friends, was an all-pro NFL hit. And it's first and ten. Hey, Bricks, you were hit more than a few times like that in your career. 140 times to be exact, and one game to be more exact. During one play, to be more and more exact. It wasn't even a game, actually. Coach just laid into me on the sidelines. Second and three. And he snatches that one out of the air for a first down. See if they can get something going here. And it's first and ten. And that's the way you play a guy. Nice coverage. Second down and ten. Steering a pick six, but dropped the interception. And it's why he's on defense, schmuck. Third down and ten. <laughs> At this point, with multiple interceptions, the QB should just throw it. He's leaving a wake of destruction in his path, and the body toll continues to climb. He's at the 20. He's at the 10. He scores! He earned those points on the heels of an epic... Hey, yeah, Fricks, check the rule book. Is that a penalty? Why would I have the rule book? Oh, for fuck's sake. <laughs> the insane cults do their sacred ritual blood dance after taking apart the opposition in a win by forfeit. They come up big today with a solid win, and the opposition will be licking their wounds on the long plane ride home. I heard wounds taste just like chicken. How was it? Scrambles tomato soup. Wounds. Mm -hmm. Good. The MVP is about to inspire us with some words of wisdom. Yeah, right. Putting three words together for this guy is like you doing a Rubik's Cube. What's a Rubik's Cube? Moving on. <laughs> with Brickhead Mulligan and Bricks Jr. and all the folks at Evil SN want to thank you for watching this presentation of the Mutant Football League. Today's game was brought to you by Comcrack Entertainment. They're not happy until you're not happy.